as you can see, it's early in the morning. I'm up running around. Guys, I kind of screwed up on the um the thingy. Cause see that car right there? That's the rental. Right there. That silver one. Um it is not May 5th. <laughs> it's May 1st. I am so crazy. Now, the rental that we are occasionally driving in right now, which I'm about to actually start and uh, get it nice and toasty, is this car right here in front of the building. It's an Equizon. Equinizer, one of Equinox, whatever you call this daggone thing. This is the rental. Um, it's a nice rental. It's a very, very beautiful rental. Um, license plate, Georgia, Georgia. Okay, so yeah, we got nice trunk in the inside. Far side, it's beautiful, it's nice. Uh, so fucking tired. Morning. Uh, so fucking tired, exhausted. Rental is actually interesting, extremely interesting. Oh god, getting in the car is pain due to my pockets. It comes with. A push start button right here touch screen let you know about to warm this car up you gotta hit the brake push this button car starts the steering wheel right here is very interesting uh, it was a full tank yesterday but we was running around having some fun before we actually decided to actually head out and we had last um on top of that let's turn down the music all right on top of that this is the system the stereo all that i gotta turn that off because the car is cold the passenger seat the back seat. Sorry, guys. I'm not getting in there. Then you got the weird head thingy. That's what I said when I was pushing buttons. I don't know what these things is. Because it don't make no sense. <laughs> um, <coughs> but it's a nice car. <coughs> Excuse me, guys. <coughs> Dry throat. It's a nice car. As of right now, my wife is upstairs getting herself ready. Um, my mother-in-law is somewhat getting ready. I don't even know if she's up yet. I called her and she didn't respond back. I don't know. Um, we're going to go out and eat. I had to do this thing early because I don't want a parking ticket. And you know, when you get a parking ticket, it's a pain in the butt. You get it in the mail. So, if you actually get it done over here, you got the parking meter, which is right there. And parking is free at night until 8 o'clock in the morning. So, I beat the buzzard by a lot because there's just one lady that constantly comes over here on the block at this time, which I scoped out more than once when I had the rental. And um, she uh, looked at the car that I was in. But she couldn't give me a ticket because I was in the car. You know, the thing is, when you're in the car, they can't give you a ticket. They can't give you a ticket at all when you're in the car. Because they can see you're sitting there waiting for somebody. So there's no way to know how they can give you a ticket whatsoever in the car. Uh, New York is a whole different story. Because you could be sitting in the car in front of the fucking cop or the ticket person. And they give you a fucking ticket. And that's some bullshit. You sitting there warming up your car, and then here they come right behind you like, <laughs> sorry, you know? It's crazy. Is this person running across the street waiting for that car? I don't know. I saw somebody running. Oh, she is running. What's she running for? Run!
Run, Forrest, run! Run, Forrest! I don't know. I don't know why she's running. Unless she's late for the kitchen. She late for the kitchen? I don't know. This bitch is running, though. Yeah, she said she should. She, this is just the chick. That's the chick. Hold on. It's about to pass the freaking Mustang. Ready? There's the chick. She was running. How you running in fucking house flip flops, yo? <laughs> I don't know how you do that. But anyway, guys, I hope you actually enjoyed this. Um, I did kind of screw up with the um video at the beginning. I said May 5th. It's actually May 1st of 2021. Yes, this is the Saturday, the first Saturday of May. And we are definitely celebrating my grandmother's birthday. As you can see right now, it's cloudy. Um, hopefully the skies clear up because yesterday while we was out, it was supposed to be freaking nice and come to find out it was off and on. It, it, you know, it was supposed to be cloudy, no rain, no nothing. And come to find out it rained, but it wasn't really that bad, but it was very windy yesterday. So today, hopefully it will be a nice Saturday and there would be no rain so we can actually go out and enjoy the family gathering so guys i will see you guys later um i'm warming up the car as you can see it is almost warm um never move your car when you see your gauge like that just want to get people pointers never move your car when your gauge is like that and the reason why is because it messes up your engine I don't know how many people actually drive off with a cold engine. I understand it's cold and you're running behind. And when you drive, it warms up the car faster. Don't do that. You're not giving the car enough time to heat up the motor and get the motor responding correctly. When you change your gears, it moves something out of place. All right. That's why half of these cars that you notice is completely messed up people are jumping in their car and they're just taking off do not do that please guys that's a full lesson for you guys don't do that um but other than that i'm going to end this i love you guys i'll see you guys later peace